Okay, hello. <clears throat> all right, friends. So, good morning, all. And I'm here. Namaste to everyone and wish you all a Merry Christmas, first of all. And it's our 25th of December, and I'm sure all of you are preparing for your year end celebrations. Instead of just wishing you um, Happy New Year, first of all, I will wish you something else. Wish you a uh, very disciplined, wish you a uh, very self controlled, wish you a uh, very focused, wish you a uh, new year with uh, good, proper habits. Wish you a uh, mentally stable, strong, and emotionally balanced new year. That is what I'm saying. That is what I want to say. If you do that, dear friends, if you do that, fine. That's, that's more important. Nothing is more important than that. All these things will fall in place. So let's start here. 23. How to make the year 23 as the best year for communication skills? Dear friends, in the year 23, um, job issues are there, will be there, recession is there. Yeah, I mean, it has been talked uh, that recession is there on the doors, joining a new company or changing the new company, uh, getting better job or better opportunities is difficult. And everyone is having good technical skills, but good communication skills is a must and it's very rare, very difficult. Unfortunately, many of you uh, don't have the right guidance. Many of you think that the grammar is the way for communication or accuracy, perfection is the way. It's not like that. Today, I'm going to tell you Five, five important tips. I'm going to tell you five important tips. No, 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 don't worry. I'm not going to teach you the sentences and English and the vocabulary and the, 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 no. These are the five tips which will really make a big change in your communication skills. And you can meet me, you can message me after one year and you will realize what I'm trying to tell you. But before that, let me again fold my hands and say thank you to you that uh, yesterday we crossed 500 subscribers. 500k subscribers, 5 lakh subscribers, and it's all because of you. Thanks a lot, dear friends. My channel is different. We are working on mindset. We work on psychology. We work on thought process. We work on long-term solutions. We don't have any shortcut solutions. We, we, we work on self-discipline. We work on consistency. We work on habits. We are not working on grammar and taking down the notes and accuracy and perfection. No. Many of you messaged me that, sir, your channel is the best and the different channel. Your content is so unique that it is nowhere anywhere. I mean, thanks a lot for this. And you people have subscribed my channel. You follow me. I make videos for you. Today I'm here for you. It's all for you, dear friends. Thanks a lot. I, I really owe you. You're, I motivate you, but you motivate me. You bestow that faith in me. You, you trusted me. I owe you all. I thank you all. You trusted me. You subscribed my channel. You follow my philosophy. You believed in my teaching methods. I believed in my teaching methods, but I was not sure whether students will believe and so nice. We have students from all over the world. Thanks a lot for this. So without further delay, we will start. And if you have pen and notebook, write it down. Five, five important tips, planning tips for the year 23 to make it the best year for communication skills. But not only communication skills overall, because here on our channel, we just don't work on communication skills because dear friends understand communication skill, English fluency, confidence. Many of you message me in the chat. Many of you messaged me in the comments that, sir, uh, how to work on my reading skills, how to work on my writing skills, how to work on my interview confidence, how to work on my public speaking confidence, how to work on my fluency, sir, I forget words, sir, I'm not able to speak properly. I, I, I get stuck when some fluent person is in front of me. All these things are a result, dear friends. They are the results, what you seek for. But that will not change unless some things change here, 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 here. In between these two years, what's happening 
what's happening and that's the first tip write down the first tip first tip is don't fool yourself in the year 2023 don't fool yourself <laughs> yes oh, what do you mean sandeep patel don't fool yourself means what i will tell you stop fooling yourself dear friends we have been doing since many years maybe you have done in the year 2022 fooling yourself and thinking that things will be fine year 23 will be the best one my life will change all will be fine i will get a better job better opportunity stop that don't fool yourself and you are the most easiest to fool let me tell you one thing you are the most easiest to fool because we can fool ourselves so easily by denying the reality by denying the reality by thinking that no it doesn't exist no problem exist you have to accept it my communication is not good now i can improve in uh, one month stop fooling yourself i will give 10 minutes daily and be better communicator stop fooling yourself stop that first be honest with yourself why i am not good communicator 2 3 hours you spend on youtube watching random videos stop fooling yourself stop that it's not going to happen social media i get half an hour on one hour instagram and reels and all that stuff stop fooling yourself it's not going to change first this year be honest with yourself and tell yourself i am not going to fool myself the reality is in black and white whatever actions you are doing whatever your behavior is take responsibility for that don't live in fool's paradise don't look at the year 2023 with rose colored glasses the reality is different stop fooling yourself now and be realistic and accept that if you want to change your communication you have to change your behavior your intention is not enough your behavior is important intentions everyone has everyone intends to be good communicator fluent speaker you want to use vocabulary nicely easily but you are changing the channels i will tell the last point you are changing the methods you don't have a proper vocabulary notebook you don't have the proper system you don't have the proper habits you don't have the library you do you, you are just randomly uh, watching one video after stop that stop that stop that stop fooling yourself first thing open your eyes and first of all tell yourself it's not going to work i have to change myself i have to plan i have to go for new strategies as i said before 2023 is not going to be easy and I, as i said before wish you a happy new year but don't fool yourself by just hoping that new year will be happy it's not going to be happy if you don't work on yourself it will be again a disaster so you have to be honest with yourself first point taken down great second point first take care of your what what is there inside mental health first take care of your emotional health first take care of your thought process first take care of your what's happening here inside be aware of what's happening here be aware of what you are thinking be aware of the way you are thinking is right or wrong in short in short do you have the self control do you have the discipline what is your thought process what is your thinking style how are the emotions how do you deal with your emotions how do you deal with the thoughts negative thoughts positive thoughts what you are doing with this 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 this, this. what you are doing with this the point i told you don't fool yourself is connected with this all the points which i'm going to tell you they are connected with this all is here first take care of what you are thinking most of the time you are thinking ah i can be good in 6 months stop that i can be fluent in 2 months stop that i will keep on wasting my time and i will be forget that it's not going to happen first get this right first your mind must be stable first you have should have good self control how to have self control okay there's a different ball game but before that 
if you really want to have this in control, start meditation first. I have done many videos on meditation. My podcast is there. First meditation and then work on your thoughts, work on the rationality, work on your thought process. See that you have OQP, only quality people around you. The self-control is more important. Methods are, um, are there on my channel. But what about the self-control? What about the thought process? The enemy is not outside. The enemy is inside. The enemy outside can't harm you more. The enemy outside can't harm you more than the enemy inside. Enemy is inside. Competition is not with outside. Competition is with inside. What is the thought process going on? What kind of thinking you have? What kind of beliefs you have? Are they right beliefs? Are they taking you towards the right direction? Whatever many of us think that, no, I think it's right. It's not right. Go and check that. Are you thinking really right? Go and check that. And we don't know that we are thinking right or wrong. And that will only happen if you work on your meditation, dear friends, if you work on your meditation. If you have good friends around you, only quality people, your friends will impact your thought process. What you're watching is going to impact your thought process. The movies you watch, the social media posts you see, that's going to affect. Spending two hours on social media, what will happen here? Garbage. What will happen here? What will happen here? First, take care of this. Every day, 15 minutes for meditation is a must. Don't say that, sir, I'm too young for meditation. It's for everyone. Don't say it's for, uh, it's not for 18 years old or 25 years old or 30. It's, it's not for 70 years old. It's for everyone because everyone needs to take care of your mental health. If you want to change anything, first change your mental health. First take care of your amygdala. First take care of your prefrontal cortex. Only then things will change. Hope you are going to stay with me. I don't know how many of you have left it. Lack of patience is a problem with mental health. Let me tell you that. You just come and see what who is Sandeep Patil, huh? what is he doing, huh? communication skill, huh? okay, now leave it. Again, this is a problem with mental health. You can't watch one video for more than one minute. What are you going to achieve in life? You have to work on that skill for 10, 15, 20 years and you can't see one video for two minutes. How are you going to work on this? How, 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 what, what's, what will be the achievement? If you come here and see Sandeep Patil is live, what he is telling, uh, communication, no, 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 go and see another video. Gone. What is the mental stability? What are you going to do it? Stop fooling yourself just now, I said. Have patience. Have patience. Be wise. If you can't watch one video for more than two minutes, my YouTube statistics tell me, show me that people, most of the people leave after three minutes. And one of my friends was saying, they watch a video for three minutes. You are lucky. Usually the, the watch time is 1.5 minutes. I said, 1.5 minutes, they're going to watch and decide how is the video. If you're going to decide the content of the video only based on the thumbnail, then need to work on your mental health. If you don't have patience and if, you're, if you can't watch my live session for 30 minutes, I don't know, maybe 30 minutes. That patients are not there. Now, how are you going to work on your communication skill? Communication is equal to patience. Let me write down this point. Communication is equal to patience. You can go and study a subject for 12 hours for four days and get 60%. Communication is not like that. Communication is not like go and cram and then go and vomit it there. It's not like that. The English which I'm communicating right now, speaking with you, it's not by hearted English. Next point, point number three. Writing down, point number three. Don't do big changes. Do small changes in you. As I said before, I'm not going to give you any timetable or the format, huh, Monday, this. As you know, nothing is going to work. You're going to stop that. As you know, like everyone is very enthusiastic up to first 15 days and 20 days and a lot of videos will be uploaded. How to make the year 23 the most successful year of the life. The, my plan for 23, da, 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 da. And uh, till the February starts, the videos are also gone. Your motivation is gone. And you are back to normal, what you did in the year 2022. So I'm not going to tell you all the plan. I will tell you the right strategy now. See here. 
forget that english and communication and all forget that first strategy forget that and now make small small changes in you don't make a big change 3 hours of reading no use read one page every day small two pages every day i have told many changes in my on, on my channel i have told you if you are my subscriber you know that what i'm trying to tell you i can't tell all the things make small small habits develop small small habits and most important develop 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 that develop that discipline in you small small discipline small all right okay today i will work on my two vocabulary words fine no problem today i will reduce my youtube time watching random videos i will not i mean i, I just the point here is random videos the video has nothing to do with your life are you you are so curious that you will watch anything and what about the time i mean no your time is does it have value or not your time is not valuable if you think then your life is not valuable you think i'm watching video for example every video will have a title china and pakistan and india if that video is there you are going to watch ha huh, these are my enemies re if you want to fight with the enemies develop yourself first develop yourself only then you can serve the nation if you become a good scientist if you become a good it engineer if you become a good teacher you can serve the country through your work by watching these videos i think is going to change get better in communication you can get better jobs you will help your family you will help the society you will help your mom dad your brother sister that's 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 the important thing so small small reduce this small small habits and get better into small let me explain you exactly read a book i have told i will make more videos 30 minutes is possible for you start there decide okay uh, every day at 7 am for 30 minutes i'm going to, don't do anything else develop this system system is more important than result forget the results develop the system start small and most important thing if you stop after 15 days after 20 days and most probably after one month all these things will be boring they will be monotonous and dull they will be at that time this is called as the burnout phase this is called as a burnout phase you will burn out at that time you have to as i said before control your mind don't force yourself and keep on doing take a break play go and play play means what take a break of one day or two days go for some vacation don't watch any movies and entertainment sit and don't do do physical activity go for cycling go for trekking take a break spend time with your family go to a farm go in village see what happens fresh again come back again start with your habits reading is there listening is there working on vocabulary is there speaking with your friends is there start with that getting my point okay now the fourth point i will not take much of your time only 30 minutes write down come on guys come on come on come on write down some are not writing why 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 notebook then what is this if you don't have pen and notebook i'm not here to give you any preaching we are we are doers it's not a preaching pen notebook is required i always keep pen and notebook if you don't have go and get it now and write it down if you don't have pen and notebook it means your intentions are there but your behavior is not there if you don't have pen and notebook then it means you are only serious about english but not serious about the methods and the habits and the discipline and nothing is going to change so keep your pen and notebook with you next point stick with one method this year stick with one method you want to be a good communicator fluent stick with one you are taking my method stick with my methods don't keep on changing this video i will now look at this trainer is telling this this trainer is telling this what you are doing guys imagine in a room there are 15 20 rabbits and if i tell you go and catch one rabbit what will you do run after this rabbit that rabbit that rabbit whichever i can catch. randomly you are just running and chasing and uh, trying to catch one rabbit what will happen nothing you will not be able to catch any one rabbit 
do one thing choose a rabbit okay this rabbit only chase that rabbit now forget all that 18 19 rabbits and chase that rabbit and see you will be able to catch that rabbit same thing there are hundreds of channels on english communication if you trust me follow my channel if you trust anyone follow that channel i am not saying that i am my channel is the only one my method is the only one but my methods i have seen that they are very authentic natural no shortcut and i believe i am very confident about my methods you can decide but don't keep on changing i have seen people this video they watch see the problem is watching only doing is not there only watching english communication channels and then writing down the vocabulary writing down the phrases how to use this how to the only watcher we are only watchers watching the shorts watching the videos doing is nothing it's like you want to be a good bodybuilder you go to gym and watch everyone how they are working out hmm very nice you watch a video on okay how to develop biceps and triceps and all only watch doing nothing and you are watching multiple channels what is the use of that you are asking multiple trainer what is the use of that <clears throat> stick with one method stick with one method focus on one rabbit and stop that watching habit and get doing doing is going to change knowledge is not going to change accumulate more knowledge what is this watching a video is just like getting more knowledge knowledge plus no action is equal to garbage lot of knowledge people have okay uh, i have seen the video how to greet people are it's knowledge go and speak take actions what is the use of this you have lot many people say, oh, i have lot of english in my mind but i can't speak because you don't speak you have to go and take action and for that stick with one method i have given the method i have given the habits i have given the schedule follow that and go and speak that's most important go and speak communication is about doing you are not into a academic classroom where you go and sit down and take down the notes sir is telling da, 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 da. communication is not like that communication is about doing communication is on about going on the stage overcoming the fear that nervousness that anxiety is there it will be there always there it will be i know that and that is all about communication that is all about developing you have to go through this fear you have to go through this nervousness you have to go through this failure you have to go through this taunting that judging you have to go through this so stop watching don't be a spectator be a player get into the ground get on the stage and start doing go and talk to your friends go and find a english speaking buddy go and talk to your boss go and take actions but take actions and last point note it down don't note it down don't check your english development yeah you heard right you what don't check and how will i come to know that my english is improved or not that is the biggest mistake you are doing communication cannot be measured speaking cannot be you can't measure speaking ha you can you can measure your reading skills yeah reading how many questions are correct okay out of 30 20 are correct listening you can check okay out of 40 how many are you can't quantify speaking and what do you do is after one month and you ask your friend do you feel a change in you stop doing that stop doing that if you do that you will not improve understand if you keep on checking and thinking about your english you will not improve that is a fact actually please understand stop that english develops unconsciously you just focus on the methods focus on the system focus on the attitude focus on the discipline english will be taken care of stop thinking about english i have seen people messaging on the comment same thing same student messaging again sir my english is not good sir i am not fluent 
Sir, my, I forget my vocabulary. Sir, my vocabulary is weak. Sir, I get nervous while speaking. Sir, I got rejected in two interviews. I'll tell you, if you want to tell, listen to the fact. Many of my students are HRs. They say that out of 100, they are given a like percentage. 5 to 10%, even not that, are good in communication. And when a student comes inside and when he speaks only two, three lines, we understand. Go, goodbye. Thank you. See you. Bye-bye. Go. These people come to me and say, Sir, help me. I want to be selected. Are you guys? 30, 40 years, 20 years, you have neglected your communication. And now you only you're thinking about English, 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 because you need it. English will not come because you need it. English will come to you if you deserve it. So be a deservable person. You can't chase English. You have to attract English. I remember a nice line in Three Idiots. Amir Khan says that, Kamiyabi ki piche mat bhaag. Tu kabiliyat ki piche bhaag. Kamiyabi apne aap teri piche aayegi. Yeah, that is what 23 is all about. It's all about. Communication will get better, but slowly. Slowly. Don't focus on English, my English. You will quit. Communication is a very subtle process, very slow process, very unconscious process. It's, it's happening, it's developing. You enjoy the process. Forget the English. Forget the English. Friends, I repeat the, the points again before I wrap up. First, and if you have any question, type in the chat. I will see the questions. First, don't fool yourself. Don't fool yourself. And you are the most easiest to fool. Be honest with yourself. Don't give excuses. You're digging your own grave then, if you're giving excuses. Second one, take care of your mental health. If you're mentally fit, you can achieve not only communication, anything in life. That's very important. Very important. Next one. Do small changes in your habits. Do small changes in your habits. Don't make a big change. It will not last. It will not last. Small changes will last. Next one. Stick with one method. Whichever method you are going with, stick with that method. But see that the method you are choosing is proven method. Otherwise, if you keep on doing the same thing again and again and expect different results, it's not going to happen. Be careful what your method you are using. They are really nice. They are really proven. Okay, and last one, don't expect 15 days result and 20 days result and start checking your English in one month and two months. Stop doing that. And if you can do this, I'm sure that the year 2023 will be the best year of your life for communication, for your health, for your growth. One of my students asked me this, and I always quote this, what he asked me. I always tell all my students. See, don't expect. He said that, sir, what do you think? How my new year will be? How my new year will be? I said, it will be like past 15 years, 20 years. What new will be there if you don't change your routine? If you don't change your habits? If you keep on doing what you are doing right now in the year 22, if you continue doing in the same things in the year 2023, don't expect anything to change. Same thing will be there. Same job, same opportunities, same. Nothing will change. Your life is not going to change unless you change. First, you have to change. And change is not easy. 
I'm not saying change is easy. If change was easy, then everyone would have changed easily. Everyone would have got best life. Everyone would have become a better communicator, better job, better opportunities, better growth. Everyone. No, it's not. I, I'm just, just now I said. I'm not saying that things are, because on my channel, I, I don't talk any goody goody things. You may not like my talk, but after four years, five years, 10 years, you will realize Sandeep Patil, what he was telling was right. It was genuine and no, there is no shortcut. Definitely. Your 2023 only will be better, your communication will be better if you change all these things which I have told you. And to change these things, I am never saying that it is going to be easy, a cakewalk. That's more important. It's not. Okay, now. Yeah, one question is that Unam is asking small changes means exactly what to do. Yeah. I told if you have listened carefully, first stop wasting your time. Stop that Instagram and Facebook and trying to impress others. Stop that impress yourself first. Yeah, I, I, I talk um, hard, but I want to help you. Stop all that, the TV, those serials, that Netflix and Prime, stop that, that, that stop you. First thing you do that. And then start following the English habits, which I have told, small change. You can see your back. Take a book, read every day, four or five pages. It will be hard to read. Words will be new for you. Vocabulary, uh, I don't know, uh, what is the pronunciation of this word? What is the meaning of, oh my God, I can't understand. This is a boring book. All these things will happen. They are going to happen. Oh, listening a podcast. Oh, yeah. Small change. Half an hour. Oh, listening. Oh, don't understand podcast. Okay. I've given two senses method. Oh, that two senses method. Okay. Oh, I don't have anyone to speak. Okay. Uh, I will talk to my wife, my husband, my friend, my brother, my sister. Five minutes. Start with five minutes. Small change. Do you have a vocabulary notebooks dedicated? First, tell me. And I want to build my vocabulary. Where is the vocabulary notebook? I will write on some random pages uh, for four or five days. Uh, I will write 10, 15 words. The notebook is thrown. Finish. Vocabulary development stop. It's not going to. These are the changes which you have to do. Okay. We have here uh, Joseph. Uh, okay. The main that you, you don't have anyone to speak around. Yeah. Well, if you don't have anyone to speak, I will never say that speak with yourself because that is of no use. Speaking to yourself <laughs> is just like uh, trying to swim in four feet water. You can't learn to swim in four feet water. The water should be at least one feet more than your height. Then you will be nervous. Then you will feel, be having that fear of making mistakes. Then you will have the fear of people getting, judging you. Do one thing, find out, go in your office, you're 45, definitely you will be working somewhere. Go and talk to that person, excuse me, your English is good, can you speak with me for only five minutes and I need your help. Do that, do that. People will help, agree. Second. Now you, you may say that I'm advertising my institute, but we have world's best platform. I'm proud of the coordinator session where students from all over India and some other parts of the, of the world are there. Not only country, world are there. These sessions run from morning till night. You can join that. But again, you may think that I'm advertising my institute. If you want to join, it's okay. Otherwise, if you find a better group where these people are disciplined, they are being governed, controlled by someone, go and do that. This is the only way. No other way is there. Great. 
we have one more question okay can you please tell me morning routine of successful people see i don't know why this morning routine evening routine afternoon routine has come maybe uh, you have seen so many videos mohan motivational videos and this morning routine has come let me tell you there is no particular morning routine or anything like this do that routine and then you will be successful nothing like this go and actually see the real people forget the morning routine and focus on your discipline first even you are not required to get up at 4 o'clock everyone's time the circadian rhythm is different whatever time you get up what is the important is where do you focus on where is your focus what do you do which activities you do there is no routine or something like this find out those important things which you need for example communication skills okay now what is your routine to follow that reading and listening the podcast and speaking that is the important thing as i said before just stop wasting your time there is no routine stop wasting your time and bring these good activities in your life and delete all the bad activities out of use this activities of you that's all that is the routine great uh what is the interview okay what they see communication okay all of you see when an interviewer will interview you he will definitely see your confidence your communication your confidence but this does not mean that you have to be very fluent in english not like but your confidence is important when you face the interview and you have to be candid enough to accept that your communication is not good if it is not good and you have to tell that uh yeah i need to work on my communication and uh, yeah i'm working on that i'm taking efforts and from where the confidence will come that's the most important thing facing mock interviews you have to do lot of lot of lot of mock interviews you have to at least 10 15 20 mock interviews are required and then the confidence will come plus confidence will come when you have a speaking surrounding many of my students though their english has is not like something out of this world but still they have they are getting selected because of the confidence because to develop your fluency it is going to take time but confidence can develop in over not too much and candidly accept that i don't that's fine nothing wrong in that nothing wrong in that i mean tell just my communication is not good that but it was my mistake i accept it i neglected my communication skills but now i'm working on this i know it's going to take time but i'm sure in the next one year two years i will be better don't say months and 21 days and all one year two year i will i will manage that and then see what happens okay friends communication skill fluency confidence unfortunately <laughs> what you do is you think it's like a subject which you can do it in two months and three months and it takes months and years to get the results years don't like no you don't like what i said i know but i fold my hands and say i don't want to misguide you my dad was a teacher i am a teacher teaching is not my profession not my profession it's my passion and i will never do anything wrong tell you misguide you i remember a nice song i will sing that and then i will go for i will stop here one nice song from raj kapoor's movie i i told my students also yesterday that sajjan re jhoot mat bolo khuda ke paas jana hai na hathi hai na ghoda hai wahan paidal hi jana hai we don't do that whether you like my this live session or not doesn't matter what matters is have i done my job today wish you were very <laughs> disciplined focused hard working sincere honest new year and if you do that i'm sure the 2024 will be also be the best year because the results which you see in 2023 is the is due to what you did in 2022 and 21 and 18 and 19 and all that things thanks a lot for coming and giving me your valuable time
Bye all of you. We will meet next year. Thank you.